everyone, welcome to Two Car Pros. My name is Ryan and today I'm going to show you how to replace the engine air filter for a 2014 Ford F-150 with the 3.5 liter EcoBoost engine. Replacing your own engine air filter at home is a great way to save money, know the job is done correct, and you don't even need any tools to do this particular repair. So let's get started. So this is where we're going to start today. The first thing we need to do is unplug our mass airflow sensor because that's going to give us enough room to articulate the top of the air box. Now we can unplug our mass airflow sensor by pushing down on this tang here and then just walking the body of the connector back and off and then we can pull up on this wire holder and put it down and away. So the next thing we're going to do is undo these three clips. You just pull on them like that and then there's another one that's kind of obscured out of sight by the air intake boot. It's right over here. You can't really see it, but it's right where my pointer finger is. And you just pull that back, and we can move the top of the air box. Now we can kind of wiggle the top of the air box and move it back to the left. Oh, there we go. So we can pick that up, and move that up and to the left right there, and you can see this intake boot is kind of accordion, like an accordion. That's going to help us out there. And then, and set the top of the air box aside and remove our air filter. So the next thing we're going to do is vacuum out the bottom of the air box. I always like doing this just so no contaminants can uh, ever get into our engine. Uh, you can also just use a wet terry towel. I like the vacuum because it seems to do a little bit better job. And there we go. And we can move on. So here is our replacement unit. It is a Fram CA10262. Link down below in the description. If you don't want to use a Fram, you could go ahead and use a Motorcraft. I have left links down below in the description to a couple different options for you. Uh, Fram's kind of nice because it's available at your uh, local Walmart and they always seem to have them in stock, which is great. And uh, it's going to filter air just fine. So we can remove that from its packaging. So we can take a look at it, compare it to our old one, but it's a rectangle, it's in good shape, it's going to filter air perfectly. And we can just set that back into the bottom of our air box, just like that. Very cool. All right, so now we can replace the top of our air box, and you see these four tangs, they need to go into these four holes on the right side of the air box. Accordion this back, line those holes up, and you kind of want to come in a little bit of an angle. go and it's uh, it's a little bit of a struggle to get those uh, tangs in their homes so keep pushing on that so you want all four tangs to look like this one you can't really see the other ones because they're kind of obscured by the fender but you want all four tangs to look at this guy here see how it's nice and fully in its home in its housing that's what you want out of all four of these and then don't forget to plug in your mass airflow sensor and replace that holder and then to install this you just press it on it's very very easy until you hear that nice click. So what we're gonna do now is using our right hand, we're gonna hold down the air box, reach in here, and put these clips back into their home until we can hear those clip. Just, just like that. And don't forget the third one back here. And perfect. So that is how to replace your engine air filter for a 3.5 liter EcoBoost from 2014. I think the year span is 2011 to 2014. Uh, it's pretty easy and straightforward. You're gonna save a ton of money. A shop would probably charge you at least $60 to do this work. Uh, the air filter at Walmart was $6, I think, and it would only take you maybe five minutes. And anybody could do this. No tools required. At home, in your driveway, very easy. And uh, again, a great way to save some money because you can literally save about 10 times what you would normally pay uh, for someone else to do it. So. Go out there and do this. Go to Walmart, get it off Amazon. Link's down below in the description. Get that air filter coming and do the work yourself. Thank you so much for watching. I hope I've earned your subscription here on YouTube today. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you next time.